Welcome back to the vlogs, guys. I'm starting this in my car. No gym right now because we are going to play golf. However, can you see already the weather? It's absolutely raining. <laughs> I was going to say some sort of thing. Anyway, I'm going to start off on a drive there. But yeah, we're going to meet up with some of the boys. But it's not looking good, Brev. The weather is awful. <laughs> so good morning. Welcome back. A new day, a new time to kill it. If you're watching this and you're not going to the gym yet, go gym or go walk or re whatever you're like, procrastinating about, go do it with the vlog in the background. Let's go. Update, good news and bad news. The good news is there's no good news. The bad news is golf's canceled. Can you believe that? That's so sucky. Uh, but as you can see, the weather is bad. The, co the course is closed. Not, not just like we're not going, the course is closed. Um, so yeah, we can't play. And like we were like, well, we could call around some other courses, we could find, but it's gonna be bad weather. This is why we don't play in England in the winter, man. It's annoying. We want golf back. Please give us golf back. But yeah, I'm not sure what we're gonna do now. I think we might go and play on like a simulator to like feel something um, and also so I can get something, something for the vlog. Driving in London is the worst thing in the world. I can't find a space to park. So we're going to go and play golf simulator uh, at a place in London. Um, Calux is going to get me a McDonald's. Thank you, Calux, appreciate you, legend. But I'm actually in the, the worst mood. Golf got canceled. I'm not, I, I now drove the car to the golf sim, which I should've just left it somewhere and just, just cycled or something. Um, but I was already in my car. No, I just can't find a space. And can I, not only can I not find a space, I can't move the car. <laughs> it's just, just so much traffic. Actually, it took me way too long to find a place to park. And now I'm fuming, but I think I'm here. What a bad day. What a bad day, man. What a bad yesterday as well. Two bad days, that's not even fair. Hello, boys. Oh, yeah. Hello. <laughs> what, what, what a bad day. Have you explained what happened? Ask Cal. Yeah, no. Oh, you got hit, well, you got hit by a line bike. Yeah, a line bike. But you know what? It wasn't his fault. It was wet out there. Yeah, and yeah. he slipped and he went into the back is, of the Is he okay? Bike. He's okay. I made sure of that. <laughs> You put it with your boot or something? No, no, I just I asked him. That was the first thing I oh, said. Oh, you, you, like, you, right? you said that meant very menacingly. Like, yeah. I'll make sure of that. Now I'm feeling I four hours last night to go and charge my car for golf today. <laughs> <laughs> well, the good news is, by the way, we had to definitely address the fact that we're all wearing we got... heavy golf attire and we're like at an indoor thing. Like, the, the plan was to go, to go golf. Like, yeah. Come directly here. I feel like I'm full kit wanker. You know them guys who right. turn up. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, let's play some golf, man. <laughs> Fucking hell. All right, Calix, debut drive on this channel. <laughs> oh shit! Sorry. Actually, yeah, you did hit him. Oh, yeah. Nice. Wow. Boys, it's a good fucking start here. My first drive a second ago was, was non-registered, non so... Oh, I think it's Bunker, mate. No, All right. But he's quite a high T. I yeah. don't know why, but... That's okay, it's okay. Uh, right. Oh, yes! Is it, it's a slice yeah. in the game. Oh, yes! Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. That is the middle of the fairway. No, no, that might work. Would you? Oh, you got away with it. How is that not registered? I think it needs to be a bit more on the right side of the um, grass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, this shit. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. No, no, it's that thing that does it anyway. It should be fine. Oh, no. Is it me again? <laughs> nah, you're getting down there. Alright, alright. The person I was. Take that. You laughing at making this thing fucking shit. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> and I'll stop laughing. <laughs> Some finished, finished golfer, bro. <laughs> Some really finished golfer. Good one, man. <laughs> yeah. I'm just filming it only looks. Yeah, I basically, I am the most entertaining golf player. I've got a really hard shot here with about 3,000 trees, so I'm going to put it over them. You can't see what's up there, so therefore there's nothing. Okay, vents, okay. ventilation. Ready? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did you guys see what that was there? All right, Harry, get some air time on here. Hello, up and down for par. Par. Wow, yeah, 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 that yeah, could yeah. be in. You really got under that bitch. Oh, that actually might go in. Oh boy. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Ooh, the attack angle was good. Yeah, yeah. Harry, are you, are you half dressed for golf? What's going on? Well, I, had, like, I had this, normally I'm wearing like a jumper. Yeah, yeah. Well, okay. And then a thing, <laughs> okay. but this is my underwear. Go <laughs> golf compression, <laughs> and then blue eyes. <laughs> 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 
It has gone over, to be fair. Where's the bounce? Oh, caught that. Ah, a bit of relief there. Cool, good job, man. Good job. Yeah, get the fat stick out. Oh, look, look, got the vlog camera and everything. What is that? A six. Ah, uh, humble six. That is not going to make it. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> that's the way it should be. <laughs> that's the way it should be. <laughs> By the way, the vibes in here are horrendous. <laughs> that's a note, Randy. Why are you bringing the fire down like that? <laughs> You're up. Shut up and go. All right, all right. Get me on. Get me on. You have to really smack this. Like, you have to, no, seriously, you have to absolutely okay. smack this. Otherwise, it's not going to get to the green. He has. He's on the fair one. <laughs> yeah. Uh, is it me again? No. Uh, no. Pooey pink. It's me. You with me, I think. Oh, no. Oh. Wow. Ooh. Ooh. Did it work? Oh, well, good. Great stuff. We are exploring this golf course. That's a good shot. I'm trying new things, but clearly, no, that's, that's alright. Right. Yeah, pretty straight. Ooh. <laughs> Come with me, my friend. Come with me. All right, little par three contest right now. Uh, me up first, because I'm in the lead. I'm a bit nervous right now. <laughs> <laughs> that, that, that wall is looking pretty. Oh my god, it just looks an old. Don't hook it left. You reset. Well, don't say that. You, you always hit a fade, anyways. If you yeah. Oh, that's so. So left. No, I can't want it. Be so Bounce off the rock. 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 Okay. Yeah. Wait, uh, does he go again? Do right? I go again? Drop, and drop, or a re-hit or drop? Oh, oh. Do you want to see where you can drop? Yeah, where, where can I drop from? Oh, I wouldn't. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just re-hit them. Yeah, yeah. Oh, we could be here for a while, you know, if everyone just keeps pinging it into the wall. Oh, Nelly. If one of us get, gets a hole in one. Rock, 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 okay. Oh, who's picked his hole? <laughs> you are aiming there, though. Yeah. Okay, okay yeah. Well, well, I just said that before. Sorry. <laughs> just hit it like hella right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. This, is, that, this is money. Yeah, oh, yeah. that's so good. Yeah, she's coming around for sure. Oh, Randy, yes. I'm going for Get up there. That'll do. Oh, oh, yeah. oh, uh, oh, no, it's series three. That's a great <laughs> shot. Oh, refurbished. Yeah. I might go in. Country tree. Oh, Ooh. good. Yeah, great shot. That's so good. That is so chance. straight. Oh, my God. Oh. oh, my, my, oh that's going. It's going. too long. <laughs> that's going. <laughs> He's on oh. the green. Oh, Good job. You're the funniest guy, man. <laughs> Don't say that. <laughs> Which... <laughs> oh, no, you're actually so funny. Sorry, Coke. Oh, you broke the game, I think. Oh, Balls. Oh, no. I have to hit that. The ball won't move. It's not moving. There's no way you hit the tree in front of you. <laughs> Did you hit the tree? Yeah. Where's the ball gone? <laughs> I think it's the Astro. Yeah. Could be, to be fair. Yeah. yeah. 51 yards, a little up and down. Calic special. On the green. Ooh, I nice shot, it. actually, yeah. 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 Might have to sit a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> you're still in the middle of your Yeah, you're good, you're good, you're good. Oh. I'm still in that pile. What a shot. Oh, round wow. Take that, take that. Stop the fucking ball. Yeah. That's a lovely shot. Great shot, looks. Yeah. That's, a, that's a stay staying shot, that is. That's a keeping the man in the room shot. Right, now, I think this goes in, by the way. What, you want me to put this in? I love you, so you drop it. Oh, yeah, a little birdie. Like confetti comes up and stuff. Does it, actually? Yeah, yeah. Wow. It's worth it. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god, Cal. Oh no. <laughs> that was 
A zero. Oh. Oh, what, what's it two foot you as well? Uh, one foot, one foot par. Good, good par, man. <laughs> that was 0 0.6 foot away. <laughs> That's disgraceful. Wait, 0 0.6 foot, what is that? Is that, uh, is that cut? 12, That's less than cut. 12 inches in a foot, so 7 inches. That's that, was, that was way less than... Length. That was less than a foot. Yeah, that was, not, was, that was on the... On the rib. Yeah, oh. it was on the rib. Yeah, that was a that was a micro penis away. <laughs> <laughs> good shot, though. Good shot. I think, I think, yeah, you win that hole. That was a Drake. That was a Drake. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Calix is so close <laughs> to going home. Look at look at his ball. <laughs> Bro, can't even play our sim. Oh, not bad actually. Yeah, yeah. Good. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Oh, it's Booker. No, 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 it's yeah, true. Good. Good, shot. good shot, man. Good shot. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Par three times two. Let's go. Oh, he doesn't like it. What, what have you picked up there? Seven. Seven. Oh, this is really ruining my vlog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you're good. You're safe. Nah, no, it's not. Yeah, you, well. played, you got a little chip in there as well, chance. Got <laughs> freezing. How am I still ahead of you, by the way? I've had two other holes. It's, just, it's gone so high, it's an other. Bro, have you seen me? Yeah, I've seen you. <laughs> <laughs> 160 yards, 7 iron. Go, go, go. No, it's good. I think that's good. Hit the rocks. Oh, unlucky. Why did you get out? Yeah, you. This game don't know physics. Oh, that's the wow! Hey. Oh, mate. Wow. Hey, that, that is gross. Oh. Yeah, I should have done that first time, though, mate. Yeah. <laughs> <That's awesome. laughs> yes. I think. Yeah. Yeah. Lovely. Let's go, bro. Yeah. Sounded good. Sorry, you didn't see off camera. Calyx hit me in the head with a bag of sugar. Oh, good shot, Harry. Oh, Max, man, <laughs> you are so good. Such a really good shot. Wow. He's rolled that down like a little peach. Two putt down. <laughs> yeah, that is, that is two putt for you, mate. Sorry. <laughs> Everyone's packing away and looks is still going. Just trying to get onto that Bye, green. Buddy. What do we get? What do we get? All right, final scores. Nine holes, actually. You played nine holes. Scores on the doors. 21 over. Mm. No. Not including handicap. No, no, no. We got this one, so. What they get? They gave him one putt. Two putt par, par. Okay. Respectable. Yeah. There we go. Harry four under, Freezy two over, Randy three over, looks nine over. Oh. oh, sorry guys. There you go. Oh, five under, one over, uh, 15, okay. <laughs> Why did you wait for that look? You just kept it as it was. I'm an honest, I'm an honest man. And when I do badly, it motivates me to be better in yeah. the future. Yeah, but there we go. Good turn of the day. I still feel like shit though, but you know, all good. Thanks for playing guys. No, thank you for playing. Man. Yeah, thanks for playing. Good game, good game. Um, cool, cool. Bless. Hey, what's up, what's up? What's up, what's up? What's Which handicap? I'm a one handicap. I'm a seven handicap. <laughs> what's my handicap? He's getting into it, he's getting into it. I ain't never played before. Randolph handicap. <laughs> yeah, 32, 32 or 28. He's probably still better than Calyx, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 oh, just like that, we're back in the car, back in the whip. To be fair, actually, to say that, like, it's now, what, 12.20, got a bit of golfing, hung out with the boys a little bit. It's not the end of the world that the golf got cancelled, but it's annoying though, because we had like a lot of stuff planned for today, like potential filming as well. Uh, and like, it hasn't rained that much in England, uh, in London at least, this year. Like, honestly, not that much. And the day we decided to go out and do a big golf day, like a lot of the boys playing, it, uh, it's rained off, you know, uh, and a lot, of a lot of other people's time got wasted and stuff. But it's fine, it's fine. Um, it happens, we've got some more stuff scheduled in the future, so hopefully we get to go and do that. But fun in there hopefully you could hear it um i didn't use my mic there because obviously we're all four of us are talking so i was like let me just use the iphone microphone so it might not be the best but at least you can hear everyone hopefully uh we'll just i don't want to film each hole as well because it's like a simulator it doesn't really make much sense but hopefully you got some fun and banter there i uh, still got a lot to do this day by the way 
today. 12 o'clock, so I actually can get home. Uh, I'm packing for a trip, so I'm going on a trip soon. I'll take you guys with me, of course. I'm excited for that. It's all booked, all ready to go. Uh, and then I've got a Pokemon event tonight, so I'll take you on that as well. Yeah, it's like a new release of a new set um, with the Pokemon company. It's the actual Pokemon company, so I'll take you guys with me. I'll film that. I'll vlog that. I'm going to film it for the Pokemon channel, but I'll probably just vlog it as well. I don't see why not. Like, you know, give a dedicated video to them, like with a new intro and stuff, and then, you know, put some vlog footage into this video as well. Day's picking up now. It was fun there. I mean, I'm a little bit of a baby when it comes to bad days, you know. Like, I like to complain and stuff. I'm, I'm, a Brit I'm British, you know, but it's a good day, you know. I'm going to get home now. Um, get changed, get showered and everything, and then, and then yeah, go for, go on with the day. All right, back in the apartment, obviously, right now, after the golf, uh, I'm gonna take this time to do some admin and some invoices and stuff, and then some ace grading work. Gonna go through the applicants that I mentioned yesterday uh, and see who's good and worth, obviously, going to the next stage for a phone call or an interview. I've got a trip, like I told you, planned, uh, in a few days. I'll, of course, be taking you guys with me, but because I'm gonna go see Harper tomorrow morning, and then, a bit of the next day. I have to pack now for that trip because I'll be going straight from Knotts or up north to the airport. So need to do that. I'm waiting for a backpack to arrive, like a travel backpack. And if the backpack's good, I'll take that instead of taking a suitcase. So we'll see later. Obviously, I'll let you guys know. I'll do a little unboxing on the vlog as well. Uh, but also what I thought I'd do now while I've got a bit of time after the admin stuff is work on some music, man. Get my mic plugged in properly, get everything set up so I can you know, get focusing on music. That, that was my main goal this year before the vlog started. That was kind of like my main goal. So while I'm enjoying the vlogs and while I'm really you know, appreciative of you guys tuning in, I still need to make sure I'm on point with my music and getting that out there. So yeah, admin, invoices, ace, music. And then when the backpack arrives, I'll do a little unboxing and, and check that out. Also, I've got like a travel, like, what do you call it? Shoulder bag, but exciting. We'll see. Let's go. I just spent like Honestly, way too long, like over an hour and a half, instead of making music that I wanted to do to make this thumbnail, only for me to get to this and be like, nah, this is too fake, this is not good enough, and then settle back to just a good old fashioned vlog thumbnail. Moral of the story is less is more on every occasion. And also, I don't know, sometimes I have this like weird perfection. I wouldn't say I'm a perfectionist all the time, but I get aggravated with the small things and want to change and fix things a lot. Um, you know, and I would have rather spent his time making music instead of making a thumbnail. But it is what it is, you know. I'm not apologizing for it. <laughs> the Amazon packages have been delivered, so I'm gonna go get those right now. I'll leave my phone up here because it's easy to carry without this phone, you know? But be right back, let's get unboxing. My legs are still in bits. I always love when like YouTubers do unboxings in vlogs, but try and not show their address. Okay, so this is a travel bag I got from Amazon. Like there was one that I saw that was really, really good, but it was really expensive and it w didn't arrive within time. So I was like, let me just get this one for now. And if this is good, then I'll use it. If not, then like, I'll get the other one later down the line is what I'm trying to say. So I don't want to like say how many days we're going there for, but it's like under a week, but it's not, but it's more than like two, three days, <laughs> okay? Um, so here we go. It just looks decent enough. I've got to pack like five days worth of clothes in it though. So I'm thinking of taking my coat, the famous coat that you guys hate. Right, one thing that I really want to know is if I can put the tripod of the camera in there, in this little gap, I want to test it, but I have to take the camera off for you guys. But look, it's got like enough space in it, right? It's got like laptop area. It has like expandable bit here. So you can expand it and turn it into like yeah, this is good, man. This is good. Power bank for the vlogs. And I got two crossbody bags. Let me know what you guys think. Which one do you prefer? Okay. We gotta take both. Okay, we got a little one right here. Which obviously I've got to ch change the size because I'm still a chungus. How do you wear these things, man? It can't be like that. Yeah, okay, I'll go with that shoulder. And then I can put my power bank in here. Access everything. I just fling stuff in my apartment, you know, and then realize, damn, I've got to clean it later. Okay, I like this. This one's pretty cool. It's like passports and that. This is pretty cool and a phone. There you go. The second one, which I might take both. It depends what we're doing, you know. If we're out there and we're like, got a full day of like, being out and about, then I'll take the bigger one. Oh, this one comes with a charger. It's kind of weird. This one feels low quality though. I can't lie. But it's like, this is bigger. 
I kind of like the other one. I kind of like just taking the backpack I did in that other one. It should fit my phone charger. Okay, I'm going to quit the camera right now and see what fits the phone set up in, okay? Here we go, off out now for the Pokemon event. Um, all ready to go. I'm feeling a bit, like, just low right now, man. Like, I think so much of the vlogs, like, every day um, has been a good distraction. But then I'm like, you know, I don't know. I guess feelings and things come rushing back, you know? But anyway, let's get to this event. I'm getting an Uber. But yeah, I'm all good. Hopping into the Uber right now. I think this is it. So let's do this. All right, so I'm not actually sure what this is, but I think it's here. It's the Pokemon event for the new, it's the Pokemon launch event for the new set, but I don't know what it actually entails or how I actually get into this place. All right, so this is the right place, but someone's coming to let me in. So yeah, it's just like a restaurant right now. People are just eating their food. And I was like, surely that's not the event where people are just eat and I'm turning up like, hi, I'm trying to find some <laughs> Pokemon cards. <laughs> but I think someone's coming to meet me, so bless. Okay, here we go. How's it going? Yeah, how's it going? Good to see you. Good to meet you. Yeah, that's the one, that's one. I was confused. I was like, surely it's not this, you know? All right, no worries, no worries. <laughs> I'll hold on. There we go, look, Pokemon. Come on. This bag's kind of uncomfortable right here. It's kind of annoying. How's it going? I'm good, I'm good. How's it going? Yeah, blessed. Good, good, good. Well, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, sure. Hello, how's it going? Hello, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. What do you need? Randolph or oh, oh, Andrew. Andrew Shane, maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've confused you with names. Yeah, literally. Like, Andrew was Randolph. <laughs> yeah, it's always different. Nice to meet you. Yeah, all good. So, this Sweet. is for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can open one now. Okay. The rest for later. Okay, one now, actually. Uh, yeah, Got you. and then I'll put one of these on as well. When sure, sure. Oh, let's go for this one. Thank you. And then there we go. I'll stick it to your hand. <laughs> <laughs> nice one. You can put your coat there in your bag. I'll leave it on, I'll wear it. Nice one, nice one. Hello, how's it going? Good to see you. How, are you happy to be in the vlog? Yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah, I see your TikToks all the time right now. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah, I've seen them everywhere. <laughs> Every day, it's like some, you've gone somewhere else. Yeah, yeah. You know? All right, so here's the event. Oh, hello, hello, how's it going? How's it going? Nice to see you. Nice to see you. Hello, hello. Oh, how's it going? Good to see you. I'm good. Also, cake pop. Cake pop. Bless, bless. Oh? Sure, what is it? Um, it's a buttermilk fried chicken. So buttermilk no, fried chicken? Chili honey glaze. Come on. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Cool. Alright, let's see what drinks we got. Okay. Hey, how's it going? I'll get the pale ale, please. The Crate Brewery. Thank you. Thank you. Nice one. Thank you. Cheers. Appreciate it. Alright, well, bless. Cheers, guys. Let's go. Alright, let me show you around the rest of the event, I guess. So we've got these packs. So we've got what, four packs right there. I can open one now, they said. Should I open it right now? Okay, screw it, screw it. Let's open it now. For those who don't know, what happens here, or what's gonna happen, I'm guessing, is we're gonna battle. Like, look, there's an EX deck here. So we're gonna use the deck to battle, and then you're gonna open three extra packs to add to the deck, I think. So let's open one right now, and the rest will be open later. Um, I feel like we don't wanna get something good now. We wanna get something good later, realistically. All right, here we go, Mam Jr. Haunter, Noibat, come on, Chameco. Kilowatt Troll, Artisan, Curlier. All right, we're gonna get a banger, guys. We're gonna get a banger. My boss stiff. Okay, we did not get a banger. But listen, we've got three more packs to come in the video, and we've got this big box here to get through. Let me show you the rest of the stuff that's happening here. I don't really know what's going on, to be honest. I just arrived, but apparently there's a Pikachu over there, so we're gonna go check that out. Look at that. Putting around, having a great time. I want my hope. Is it me next? Well, no, I'll hold it, mate. I'm a vlogger these days. Hello, how's it going? What's good? What's good? Hey, bam, sick. <laughs> Let's get a, get, get a thumbnail look, look at this. Wow, okay. Nice, it's nice to meet you. Yeah, what's good? Let's go, let's go. Banged it, smashed it. <laughs> wow. Wow. Yeah, let's go. This is sick. <laughs> Great. <laughs> All right, I'm not really sure what the plan is right now, so I'm just sitting chilling. I'm gonna do your taste test with Randy. You guys like me trying things right. I've got another one of these things. This is a fried chicken and honey thing. So here we go, pop that in. Dinner. For the second time now, very good. I've already had a few sips of the, of the beer, the pine, the, the IPA, but we'll go again. Yeah, that's good too. Nice. The chicken, I'm gonna go for like an eight, you know, seven out of 10. The pint, well, it's not really a pint, is it? What is that? Like a, a fifth of a pint. Then I'm gonna go for the, I'll give, I'll give the drink a, yeah, seven as well. Okay, Pokeball, cake pop, dinner. All right, let's, let's give it a go. 
I don't make the rules. Or oh, you know the rules. What does Bebo say? I don't know. Oh wow, chocolate. That's good actually. That's an eight out of a 10. Eight out of 10, let's go. Really appreciate you guys coming down. Um, obviously we're here to celebrate the launch of Pardon Fates. Um, <laughs> all right, mini games, let's go. I'm gonna win, I'm gonna win them all. I'll be the best. <laughs> hey, here we go, look at, look at this tripod. That's all you need. That's sick though. All right, unboxing this, we've got Greninja. If you don't like Pokemon right now, I'm so sorry for the vlog, but screw it, man. Oh, I, just, I do that all the time when I'm opening boxes, I just rip them. I have no patience. Yeah, I have done that, I just rip mine. There you go, here's our boy. Although technically you're not supposed to call them boys. It, here's it. Oh, what I hate about this is no sleeves ever. I'm gonna go ahead. Yeah, I always win, let's go. Let's go. Right, if you guys want this, there you go, scan that in. Right, here we go, here's our deck. Water. Let's go, let's go, what else we got? Oh, pneumonia. That's me when I'm, oh, Froakie's the goat, man. Froakie's so sick. Wiglet, Diglet, but with the W. Frogadier. Quack Pavel. Right, I'm already got my prize cards, my deck. Let's go, apparently it's like a little mini game. You only get 10 cards or 10 Pokemon per one, so. Or like nine Pokemon, 11 energies, and they're all basic under 70 HP. I want to open these, man. I might just do it. Why not? Let's go. Let's go. It's my, it's my third one. Come on. 40 on me. All right, draw a card. Wiglet. All right, I'll put energy on me, Quaxley. Nah, go for it, man. Go for it. Let's go. Come on. All right, now I'm filming a coin. Heads, 30. Come on, let's go. How many have you got? 60. It's gone. Let's go. All right, it's my turn. One more heads right now and I get the last prize card. Can we do it? Okay, you know what, I'm, okay. It's, a bit, it's too big, it's too big. The place always heads. Oh my gosh. It was heads. Nah, but I'll go again, I'll go again. It, listen, it was heads, but listen, I'm honourable. I'm honourable, okay? We're gonna go again. Right, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Oh my goodness me. It's heads again. It's heads again. I'm so sorry. Zigzagoon's gone. Victorious. I'm not sure why it's such a basic version of Pokemon. You got 20 cards and like two Pokemon. Yeah, it's not great, but good game. Good game. I'm not gonna lie, I wanna take these and run away with them. Oh no. It's been, it's been robbed. Damn it. It's been stolen. But look at this. Dude, this is sick. Charmander. Pikachu just chilling, man. Look at that. But anyway, shout out to Pokemon, guys. Shout out to Paldean Fate. It's a brand new set. Check it out right now. Get some packs. Get some shiny Pokemon. You could pack this one. It's probably worth a pound or two. So get it. Get it now. There we go. Look at that. Charizard. That's what everyone loves the most. That's what everyone cares about right there. Charizard. The main Don. Shout out to Pokemon for inviting me. Appreciate it. Uh, probably gonna quit now though because I need to pack for this trip. I haven't packed yet, so yeah, I might head out. But thanks, Pokemon, again. Appreciate it. Although, it's still one of it's still one of these for the journey. I'm not joking. I'm literally still in that for the journey. It was so good. These are going crazy, man. Look at this. Look at these shenanigans. On the way out, got this. Look at that goodie bag from Pokemon. I'm gonna open it when I get back. Show you what we get inside. But look at that, man. Let's go. Overall, a sick event though. Thank you so much to Pokemon for inviting me. Now let's get back. Look at this rain, man. Stupid rain. Stop the golf from happening. Where am I? I don't even know where I am. It looks cool though. I am really in no mood to pack, but let's get these cards open and this goodie bag unboxed so I can start packing and be an adult. I hate being an adult. Okay, I'm gonna take everything out first, then we'll do the packs together. So first up we have a tin of the new set. Unfortunately, no Charizard tin, that would have been nicer, but it is what it is. Some more packs. Thank you again for Pokemon for giving me this goodie bag and inviting me to the event. Very, very cool that I get to do things like this. I really do appreciate it. We have some stickers, cool. Three mini tins, oh my goodness me, let's go. We have, Ooh, what is this? Oh, no way. Is that like a journal? 
Wow, okay, you know, maybe I'll, no, no lie, maybe I'll write in this. Uh, also guys, don't forget to check out my website, pokerand.net, if you want to pick up any Pokemon products, we have all this, all this stuff, we have it on the website, believe it or not. And also check out hgrading.com, hgrading.com. And, and the last thing is, wow, this is cool, a little Pikachu plush, but it's like, corduroy, right? Is that how you say it? Sick. We've done so many packs today already, I'll only do a few packs for you guys, unless I get addicted. But there's the promo, by the way, in the uh, front of the tin, very nice. I'm actually gonna put a flash on for you guys, because it makes the cards look so much cooler. And again, I apologize in the vlog if you guys don't want to see Pokemon content, but I got invited to the event, so I'm showing it to you guys anyway. You know what, I'm not gonna apologize. I need to be more confident with what I'm posting, right? You guys like to see anything I do on these vlogs. It's very wholesome. Okay, here we go. We're hoping for something sick and shiny, as you guys can expect. Let's see what we get. Charmeleon right there. What a Pokemon. Ultra Ball. Primeape. Okay, Noibat. Let's go. Woobat and A. Ooh, Iron Treads. Okay, cool. So we actually got the Iron Treads special shiny version here as a promo. And then the regular one is right there. Pikachu on the next pack. This Paldean Fates set is the third iteration of the Fates like series. They did Hidden Fates, Shining Fates, and then now Paldean Fates. But Hidden Fates was the set that started my Pokemon channel, which then obviously started a massive, massive, massive... Oh, we got something here. We got something, guys. What do we have? We have a Wug Trio Shiny. Let's go. Look at that. Cool. But yeah, Hidden Fates is the set that started my, I guess, Pokemon channel, which grew into the massive thing that it is today, you know? No Pokerand.net exists without that. No AceGrading.com exists without that. Can you believe that? That's crazy. And obviously Ace is the huge giant that it is right now. And it's only getting bigger and will continue to only get bigger. So thank you guys for the support on that. Much appreciated. We have Swoobats. We have Fido. Nimona and a Amarouge. You can pull a really, really cool Charizard in this, so I'm gonna hope to pull that. But you guys can see how like kind of busy and hectic kind of like life is right now, you know? This morning I was on the way to golf to go and film a golf video, then it got canceled because uh, of the rain. Then I went to play golf at the sim and then the rest of the days kind of just happen as you guys see them, you know? Ooh, Wug Trio again. See the shiny form? So it's purple rather than pink and that one right there is a shiny one. And then we have a... Reveroom. Actually, I'm gonna open the rest, guys, because I wanna get something good, but I'm gonna do it while I'm talking to you guys, and I'll just show you something. Whoa. I can't open this tin. The plastic's still on it. I'm gonna say for a second the gym's not even working, but what I want to tell you guys real quick is something that was on, it's something that was on my mind earlier. In these vlogs, I want to continue to do the Uncle Randy, like, little, you know, speeches and talks of the camera that I've been doing so often recently. I wanna do more of those. Um, and it was something to, about like opportunities and taking opportunities. As like YouTubers, people always say that we don't work hard enough, you know, like people like me and the boys don't work hard enough or everything's luck or, you know, say like even me knowing JJ, that's why you're successful and all this stuff. And obviously look is definitely a part to it. Oh, oh my goodness me. Oh, we got Charizard EX. Let's go. I thought that might have been the super duper rare Charizard, the shiny version, but it's not. It's still cool regardless, put that over there, sleeve it up. Um, but yeah, people always say, oh, you only need this because of JJ and stuff. And obviously I'm fine with that. I don't, I don't take offense to it. But I want to speak about it and say that like, days like today, like going to that Pokemon event are things where like you have to create your opportunities. I'm really tired right now, so I'm kind of messing up my words. But the point that I'm trying to make is, we, we take opportunities, you know, we do, like today, I've been really down. And that last, you might have been able to tell through the vlogs. I've not had a good couple of days. Uh, and even though it's small things that have kind of got me down, I just haven't felt great. I've been a bit burnt out. The vlogs have been doing so well that I've felt a bit of like the imposter syndrome that I've always felt again, you know, like they're only doing well because of the boys, because of Sidemen, because of the titles. And I know that's not true. And also, by the way, shout out to the boys for helping me get those titles, taking me to Dublin, taking me to all these different things and, and, and being so supportive with the thumbnails, you know, with, with the content and allowing me to film and wanting me and encouraging me to film. Even though I know all that stuff, I'm not trying to say I don't deserve the views or I'm not trying to say I don't kind of, I'm just trying to say that this is the feeling that I get, you know? So. I don't know, when, when you go so, at least for me, when I'm going so hard with the vlogs and stuff, sometimes it's like, oh man, like just a bit of anxiety creeps in. Um, but, so the point being that I'm trying to make with all of this is that today I haven't felt the best, you know, and, and yesterday I haven't felt the best. And I didn't, I really didn't, did not want to go to this event. I did not want to go, um, I want to just kind of relax, do nothing, you know, but then there's this part in me, there's something in me that I've never ever, uh, 
let fade away and that's like the, the hunger and the drive just to keep going you know i don't know i don't know what it is like i am a very emotional person you know and, and i think i've had ta well I've, I've been down most of my life you know i can't say i've honestly felt happy most of my life I, I felt good and i've smiled and i've laughed and i'm with people but there's always been something about me that's been struggling you know and that's kind of like what i'm trying to fix this year and ultimately the relationship as well that's kind of why well big reason why it died down you know in many aspects but and I think a lot of you are recognizing that as well with the, the vlogs right now. You're seeing that this is me reaching to be something greater and trying to get to the potential that I've always had. Um, and again, these words aren't coming out as, as poetic or as like prophetic as I would like them to be because I'm just tired. But hopefully you're getting some value in this because I think it means something. What I'm trying to say is even on the days where I don't want to do something and I don't want to go out, I still will go to the event. You know what I'm saying? And that's the same thing about like even meeting JJ in the first place, being in the the... You know, making the music that I was making, the me messaging, the messages that I was sending to him, that he was sending to me, the opportunity to go to London, to go and do this, to meet him, to go and fly over there and do like, I've sacrificed so much, you know. And, and now I've got Harper. Like, you can see that even more because, like, I I'd be with her more if I could be with her more. I, I would, but I can. I can be with her more. I could move. I could stop this YouTube stuff. I could stop all this doing what I'm doing right now and just move closer and just, just you know, be her father and be within. 20 minutes, you know, still maybe get a different job, do something else. Like, I could do that. But that's not what, like, that's not the calling that I have as a person, and it's not the potential that I have as a person. Because with Harper, like, I know that I'll be a better dad and a better role model and someone that she can be proud of and look up to if I go and reach my potential, you know, and, and give her something to follow and give her something to, to learn from and, and be someone that I can teach her, you know. I don't want to teach her giving up, you know. I would not want her, if, if she was in my position, I would not want her to go and, and kind of like st step back from her potential, like go and do what you can, be who you can be. And it's like, these opportunities is, is, is what sets people like me, the Sidemen boys, JJ Sidemen, like Cal Cal, it's what sets you apart because you go and you do the next opportunity, you know, like look at, look at, look at, look bro, look at us all, us all by the way, like f the fellow studios, no two ways and everything else I've done before that, you know, you have to go out there and you have to take risks, you have to go into the wilderness, you have to do things you don't really have the comfort or necessarily knowledge to do but you fall into it and you learn as you go you know uh, Lux has learned more about shoes in the time he started new to ways than he did when he just started if that makes sense freezy has learned more about podcasting now he started than he did when he had the idea to do it then you, you get what i'm saying so you fall into opportunities that's why people say that you know you create your own look like it's a bit of a cringe thing to say but you don't create your own look, you create your own opportunities, you know, and that's what the outside people will see. Oh, it's just, you know, how, you got people, people understand like, oh, you, you and JJ were friends before. Yeah, but we're only friends through work, you know. We were only friends because I was making music. He was doing gaming. I was giving my music to him uh, to use in his background. He was watching my music and saying, can I use that? Can I? And then we had the idea to make a song together. Then that song turned into Hesky Time, you know, and then we did something else, you know. And then even when I was down and out after uni, I had nothing really left, left in me. I said to him, like, bro, I need something to do. Like, can I, I'm down to help you with whatever you need. He was like, yeah, come through, help me film this video. I had never filmed people for, for, for anyone before. I just had a camera, you know? Um, and then he got me back into it, you know? And I'll obviously always be, be grateful for that. But even that, like, there is like, is you reach out. You have to make these opportunities, man. So when you're down and you're, and you're feeling low and, and, and you've got something that you don't want to do, you know, whether it be an event like tonight. I mean, again, I love the event. You saw it, like Pikachu's there cutting about, dancing around, you know, I've got three packs right now. I'm not saying I'm ungrateful for it, but I, I could have been like, oh, I don't want to go tonight. Nah, I don't want to do this, but I did it, you know? And I'm tired, I got a pack. I, I, I would rather be here sitting, watching something, you know, but that's not me, man. You know, what is me is being out there grinding you know i could have been home and not an evening earlier to see harper but no i went to the event you know and, and that's what gets you your next opportunity that next opportunity turns into a next opportunity and it goes like that you know um so yeah just something for you guys to keep in mind i'm not saying just say yes to everything you don't have to say yes to everything but like consider i don't know it's just something to say that like it's gonna sound really cocky and really like egotistical but there's a reason the 10 of the Sidemen boys and the troops and even the wider people, you know, Theo, Chris, Reeve, uh, there's a reason why everyone met, you know? And that re oh my God, that reason is because 
we're all we have the same we have the same mindset. You know, we're, we all have something in common, especially the troops boys. You know, if you think about the troops boys, think, think about the age we're at. We all started playing COD. You know, in FIFA. Even that's how I met JJ through COD and FIFA because I was watching those videos. You know, um, but I was doing music. I wasn't necessarily making that content, but I was, I was in that community. Um, and there's a reason we're all we all made it this far. And there's so many more reasons as well. I mean, again, even the fellowship and even the, the companionship and like the companionship? That's not the right word. The, the, the colleagueness. You know, I'm saying that like even the being able to go for a meal and just talk about what's working, what's not working, you know, and, and influence each other. And what you're seeing the boys do for me is what they did for each other and have done for each other. And that's what I try and do for them as well, even on a smaller scale, you know. They say, can you come do more side I'm there no matter what, you know. They say, I mean, even Simon tomorrow asked me to do a video and I couldn't do it because I have to drive back and see Harper because, you know, Laura's going out and obviously I've got a responsibility. And I was like, I felt sick, man. I was like, I, I hate saying no to things. I can't, I hate it. But I had to, you know. But that's what I'm saying. Like, we, we, we bring each other up, man. But yeah. Go and seek your opportunities, guys. I'm telling you, I'm telling you. And, and I have friends at home, and I have family members at home, that, that, that I'm not gonna mention them, obviously, that like, you see that they don't see it the same way as I would see it, you know? And my dad, if he's watching this, will know this, and I'm sure he'll send me a text saying, I understand. Like, there's only been a few people in my life who knew this. Laura knew this as well, by the way. This is why Laura, like, was, is, has been the best partner ever. You know, she understood work, and, 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 not to get emotional now because it is tough. Like obviously the relationship has moved on, you know, and it has to go the way it's going or has gone. But like, she was the best. She understood everything. She understood every sacrifice. Even now, that, that, and, and now we're co-parenting. She understands, she gets it. And she's been one of the only people to ever understand me and probably will ever understand. She's probably one of the only people that ever will truly understand me and get me, which is why I can get emotional about this and which is why I can and, and be sad about it. But again, like the relationship Needs, you know, we both need to go now and do something else, you know. But I'll probably never find someone who understood me like she does, and that's okay as well because there's other aspects that that you know. But yeah, just wanted to say that to you guys. And, and by the way, I do feel like it's a prison, though. I will say that as well. I will. I, one big caveat to all of this is that it does feel like a prison because I would love. I told you this in one of the episodes when I was in Texas. I would love nothing more to just not have that drive, and I mean that. But I don't mean that, because I love who I am. I've got, I've got a few more packs to open. Um, but yeah, point being, guys, is take your opportunities. Oh, nice, Judge. Look at that, full art Judge. Let's go, cool. And that was the same thing with the Pokemon shop, by the way, guys. In the Pokemon channel, like, Laura was in the editor for that. If you didn't know, Laura edited most of the videos. Well, when we were popping, she edited all the videos, and then obviously she started running the store. We had employees, so she had to go and do that, so she couldn't edit every day anymore. Um, but she was a big reason of the success for, for the business, you know? But obviously with half an hour it's harder, with the distance it's harder, you know, so good things have to change. You gotta update things as well, guys. Oh, nice. Knackly, like a little baby shiny right there. And one final pack, and then let's just end the video there, you know. I'm gonna pack my clothes, I'm gonna eat. Oh, we got something. We got something. Clive, nice. That's a really sick special art rare. There we go, Clive. So shout out to the Pokemon company once more, guys. Make sure you check them out. Check out Pokemon News UK, Pokemon UK, Pokemon TCG UK, all this stuff. Um, but yeah, thanks Pokemon, appreciate it. Thanks guys for watching another vlog. Thanks for sticking with me. Um, I want you to know that even if we have vlogs where I'm out doing things with the boys and, and things are going a little bit fast, I'm not forgetting our journey this year as a community uh, and what we're trying to achieve this year for, for me and for you guys, especially more so, you know. Um, this, this kind of, these kind of vlogs are, are, are a way for me to speak. And ultimately, I, I want to do these to kind of like help you guys. Not that you need help, I'm not trying to like uh, put things onto you guys, but I know there's probably people watching this that are taking value from this and, and thinking about life Oh, it makes me emotional now, like, because I, I remember when I was like 17, 18, and I was at uni, oh, sorry, or like college uni, and I was like, you know, I just, you guys need, it's nice to have like someone to listen to and, and talk about life experiences, and now I'm older, I feel like, I don't know, I've got things to teach you guys, and, and not, not, not that I know the answers, by the way, but we do it together, because I'm learning things about you. I learned that I need to get a new shaker for my protein. I learned that you guys don't like uh, me having protein and water, even though I, li I like the taste. I don't need milk, I like the taste. I like that you guys tell me that push-pull legs is, is not what Josh and Cal meant, what they meant was, because I, I thought they meant like do a push-pull leg day on the weekend as like an interim, but they meant do push-pull leg on the cycle, and that will still land on the weekend, you know? So Monday, 
Tuesday, Wednesday, so like push, pull, legs, push, pull, legs, and that obviously there's seven days in a week, so it will go. Da, da, da. Also, has anyone seen that thread on like some sort of bodybuilding? I saw it once on like a, somewhere where they're talking about the week, the, the, the workouts and the days of the week. I don't know. Anyway, guys, love you all. I'm, this is my this is the outro now. But now, don't forget the journey that we're on this year. We've got many more videos to come. I, I want to do this vlogging thing forever, to be honest. I want to I want to hit every day. Obviously, I'll miss some days. You know, it'll be like family emergencies. It'll be private things that happen, but. I don't know, I just, like, always in my life, I find something good, and I don't maintain it with a lot of things, you know. <laughs> so, this vlog, I want to do that, man. I want to do that. So, anyway, love you all. Take care, and peace.